Hey guys, welcome to the Ender Beast. Today, my name is Jesse, and we're going to be playing some Game Dev Tycoon. I've had my eye on this game for quite a long time, so I thought we might as well play it. Um, so let's start. Before you start your adventure, you have to give your upcoming company a name. Um. Um. Yeah, let's just give them the Ender Beast. And. Uh, Beast and my first name. Yes. Girl or boy? <laughs> he gonna be ginger. Uh yeah, he's gonna be ginger. Thirty-five years. Oh look, game length. Um no, you can always continue playing after the main game is over. The game length simply specifies how fast new platforms come to market when the high score is calculated. All right, let's let's continue. So we're in the Ender Beast, and let's start by making a game. So we'll call it. Uh, what should we call it? Let's call it Beast Mode. Yeah. All right, and it can be a medieval. Uh, yeah, medieval RPG. Let's go for an RPG, and on um, definitely the PC. Uh, Archie or no, plus one. All right. Next, two D graphics. Obviously, Let's start. So. Little guy just sort of wandering away. So it's a like medieval RPG. So we are not really going to. A little bit less. Gameplay, yes. Story and quests, yes. Engine, not so much. Gameplay, a little bit more. Right. You spend your time doing that laggy piece of crap. Yeah, scratch your head. Why no, don't you? Um, right, so development stage. Two is dialogue, you don't need it. Level design, you need quite a lot. AI, you need quite a lot for that. You know, the vendors and stuff. Alright. Let's hope this isn't a complete flop. Alright, and the next one is world design, as you know. Mm, yeah, we need a bit of world design. Graphics, sound, not so much. So, my research points are going up. This is an indie game made by uh, Greenheart Games. I'll put the link to it in the description. And I thought I might as well have a go at it. So here I am. Right, let's start. Oh, this is happens to this com yeah. this computer. Whenever it tries to finish anything, it this bit lags out. I've got to go into the menu back again. All right, new combo. Great combo. Yay! All right, so engine. Nothing much happened there. No levels up, no milestones. Um, will there be a milestone here? Why is his computer popping out? Alright, oh, come on, come on, come on. Nice experience by Star Games. Enjoyable by the Informed Gamer. Oh, God, one of the fast. Six by, uh, I like it, but Game Hero. Six. Could have been more, all games. Alright, let's see how much it sells. The Ender Beast, a newcomer in the game industry, just released their first game, Beast Mode. With the game received favourable reviews with such a good start, the Ender Beast is sure to gain fans quickly. That's quite good. How many sales? Sold like 1.3, 3.2k. We made it in the charts at 28. Oh, that's pretty good actually. Beast Mode is so successful, now we have 17 fans. Wow. Beast mode 2. Just gonna wait till it all dies down. Anyway, yeah, this is an indie game about developing games, as you may have seen. And oh. and the more you got, I think it's a million when you get a million credits or cash, you um move up into a massive cool looking office. But at the moment I think we're gonna do some research. So gonna be a new topic. I like sci-fi, so I'm gonna go for sci-fi. 
Should I go for a sci-fi RPG or a fantasy RPG? No, I'm just gonna go sci-fi. So, well, my busy little mini me is doing that. We've already got 115 grand, huh? Well, I should sometime make a game. <laughs> if it works like that, that's awesome. Alright, search new toy. Look at his computer screen! Popping out of his computer! Look at that! Look at that! Alright, generating 113,000 dollars. Alright, so the G64 is better. Um, so, we need to develop a new game. Let's call it. Um. <laughs> Fred in space. Uh, space. Fred in space, and it can be a sci fi action PC. Let's go. Yep, start the development. Fred in space. Alright, engine. Not much. Gameplay, yeah. Stories and quests. As it's an action, we probably need more engine than stories and quests. So we'll put that up there. And his computer screen's gone retarded. Sorry, it's quite laggy. Because my um, computer isn't amazing. <coughs> oh, who said that? Dialogues. Uh, not much. Level design. Artificial intelligence. No, that'd be good. So is that is that if that keeps on that sorry. that keeps on going like that? Um, um anything else? Artificial change going up. World design not so much in seeing as it's an action. There. Sound not so much. Okay, let's go. Take this baby away. Graphics. See if we can finish this. Finish. Sorry, I always I will, they will be doing that quite a lot. Sorry. Lag. Um Alright, thank you. Finish. Uh, is it done? Yeah. Bonus 1.4 new topic, new combo. Uh, gameplay, story quests, dialogue. Level design, artificial intelligence, world design, alright. Jesse is level almost level two. Alright, release again. See how this works and then I'll probably have to leave it there. And I'll record the new one, uh, the next one the next time. Fred in the space. Come on, I see tens, I see ten love it. Wow, Fred in space is awesome. Nice experience, that's nice. If you give me seven, enjoyable. If you give me like a five, I'll cry. Eight. Sci-fi action is a great combo. Let's see how much money we make. Waiting for the money. 2k, 3.5, 7. Oh, this is beautiful. Hi there. I've just finished Friend Space and I'm impressed by your talent. I am the contracting business and we can use I am in the contracting business and we can use skills like yours. If you're ever short on cash, let me know and I'll see if you have some work for you, Jason. Alright, maybe. Uh, sorry about that, it'll be technical. Alright, so the inventor has introduced the TES and Fred in Space has sold 20,000 units. Wow. Uh, so I'm going to leave it there. Thanks for watching, this is the Ender Beast.